grew up in a neighborhood where um, had several people that was uh, in corrections. Um, guy across the street, you know, uh, was a captain. His son was a major. His uh, son ended up being a warden at one time. Uh, next door neighbor ended up being a warden. So uh, had a couple correctional captains on the street. Uh, had uh, a couple CEOs there too. So. Really didn't see myself getting into corrections. Uh, went to college, uh, didn't quite pan out, didn't like where I was at. Applied for corrections, got into it, and here I am. So. When they first mentioned it, you know, uh, I'm, I'm a kind of guy that I don't brag on myself or anything like that, so I guess I asked the question why. You know, I, I, it's just normal stuff I do throughout the day. I just kind of feel that maybe the stuff that I was doing, you know, people looked at, maybe looked up to, you know, because I kind of take a little pride in the work. And maybe hopefully that's rubbed off on some, you know, in the right way. So. In school, I was probably a kid that didn't say two words. Got into corrections where if you wanted to survive, you had to, you know, get up and say stuff. Um, kind of got into the side of it to where you know it's more security oriented um, started off at Lancaster, you know, Lancaster uh, Southeastern Correctional I was there for about five years transferred to Noble in uh, 96 um, unit management's been you know kind of went to a lot more programming and stuff so I've kind of you know, it's, it's gone that way the pendulum swung that way um, it's been a it's been a good ride you know most of the way Thank you.